case of Baba Ahmed is a really important one for our society. Baba Ahmed has been in prison in Britain for eight years without trial, and he's fighting extradition to America. He's being extradited on charges that the Americans want to try him on, that here in Britain, he's already been told are not charges that he could ever be face a court on. Because of the extradition treaty with America that was passed in the wake of 9-11, people can be extradited to America to be tried for something that was done in Britain. When he is extradited to America, he is likely to face a long period of pre-trial detention in solitary in a very very unpleasant conditions. Anybody who's looked at Barber's case is extremely perturbed at the idea of what might happen to him in America. The case isn't only about Barber Ahmed. It's a case of principle which involves various other young men, one of whom is the computer hacker Gary McKinnon. Both of them and another young man called Taha As Asan um, are facing being sent to America to be tried for crimes that they, if they are indeed crimes, um, that they committed in Britain. And the whole point of doing an e-petition and having it discussed in Parliament is to get parliamentarians to talk about and think about the issues of don't we want British trials for these British men? British justice for British people. If 100,000 people sign this e-petition, these questions about this extradition act could be debated in Parliament.